First day of high school and it's already boring, huh? No, that would have been the best part. What would have been the best part? Oh yeah, the best part where I introduce myself. Oh, sorry, it's William. Or Will for short. Happy now? Very. So, Will, anxious about the whole finishing school thing? Hmm. It's better leaving the future stuff for later on. Okay, though, why are you waiting for this you of the future? Don't ignore the you of the now. That's the bell, everyone. Have a wonderful first day. So, you want to come with? So put your pen to paper and see where your imagination takes you. Yeah. <laughs> Truly inspiring. Yeah. Just get a life. Where? How is this amusing? I don't understand. Where is the joke? We're looking right at it. <laughs> like Shakespeare. Oh! <laughs> You're not a joke, you know. Then who is? When you look in the mirror, what do you see? A, a, a joke. No, because all I see is commitment, self control. That real interesting head of yours. The only jokes are the people that make you feel like one. Oh, thanks. I'm not usually lost for words. Hey, you coming or? Yeah, I'll be over soon. Just start walking, you guys. <sighs> okay. Is she serious? <sighs> Sorry about them. Really. I wanted to give you this. I thought you'd be interested, since you've been awesome in class and all. Thank you. Uh, sorry, I didn't get your name. My name? It's Eleanor, or... Ellie, for short. It's the bloody writing. Why me? Why can't you just employ someone qualified? When you're older, you'll thank us for starting you early. When I'm... No! Enough! This ends here and now. No, please don't. Not this. William, your mother and I have worked tirelessly to give you a successful future. But if you say you want whatever this is, over the hard-earned privilege of our family, then it will stay a hobby. Unless you can be our guest and enlighten us. A friend gave me this because she sees him for who I am. You can too.
right at it. Get him, boy. You serious? So you can thank us for starting you early. <laughs> There is a flawed truth that over our sprouting years of youth, our lives are excused of a title. And only once we are deemed compatible with a future identity, our story is commenced with destiny in effect. Yet here I am with, on the dawn of my future, a long tamed destiny that feels farther than ever before. And thus, the real truth is unveiled. The story of your future begins now. For you are your own teacher, your own examiner, and your own author. You are the writer of your own destiny, and there's nothing anyone can do to bend that. Just don't give them the satisfaction of believing they can. Thanks to our remarkable finalists this year, the decision of the judging panel has never been harder. So without further ado, the winner of the annual writing competition is... Jennifer Bryan. As our eyes met amidst the darkness, a smile that I had only dreamed of, one of recognition, the need for education, the progress of the past and future, and my destiny. Finally, recognized. It's your turn to pursue your destiny. Just remember, you are your own author.